Turn 14. So we've got a message. Arco sending weird shit. I think it's our turn to send weird shit. Uh, so this is the adaptation of a poem by the ancient Roman writer Catullus, I think is how you pronounce it. Anyway, it's too long to read it, but you can pause the video and read it if you want, and I'll link the actual thing in the comments, or description, or whatever. Next. Yeah, you can copy-paste in a message. That's a new DOM5 feature. You can't select out of a message in copy, sadly. Uh, for research, though, I was going to change it. I need to put Thaw to 3 before we continue so I can teleport my star spawn around, which is important. Um, searching, nothing up there. We've got a message from Asphodel. That doesn't look renamed. Next, we're walking into Abyssia. I asked for uh, permission afterwards. Going straight into that ocean. Uh, 40 barbs. We're going to walk in barbs because I don't know if she's going to walk shit over there to retake this. I told him I'd leave it at 0 PD, which I'll do. So we will hold our word. Where's Abyssia? 23. Next, we've got. I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm going to pull this shit back. And I'm going to pull this shit back. And all this stuff here. And then once we have them all assembled, I'll be able to build a big pile and send that up here to clear the rest of this. I could maybe walk over there. I'm just waiting for someone to attack me. But it looks like Vandeheim respectfully went around. Which is pretty fucking funny, because I'm Relay and this is like a few hundred gold in a throne being left on the table here. Whatever, I'm not going to complain. If he's going to respect my sovereignty, which he really shouldn't. This guy, we're actually going to make scouts. Let's do that. That's cool, because I'm not going to be able to make water scouts, so I'm going to make as many of these as I can while I hold the, the province. Which may not be for too long. Uh, we did not random earth or nature. Messed up. And I actually noticed, I didn't realize this, this is new in DOM 5. I haven't paid too much attention to really since DOM 4. They have the slave tag. So, normally you think, well, what does that matter? Who cares about slave tag? They are not a commander, so they don't get, like, taskmaster. So why do they have this? Halved upkeep cost. So... 70 gold per year for this guy. And 68 gold per year for this guy, except he's 7 RP. And this dude's 13, so it's going to be 10 and 16. So this guy's like a hugely efficient researcher. I have Grow 3, he's a little old. Um, some of them will die of disease. But that's still pretty good. And they're also um, better to independently operate, because they have more than just S1. So I'm actually thinking I'm going to mass these. Even though it makes it more punishing if I bought myself, I would still rather uh, have better research. I will still, of course, make star children as required. Because star children are good assassins. You are going to pick up some crap. I think that's 20, that's enough. He'll shuttle these over to there. Um, that is on repeat. I'll leave that there for now. And we've got how many? That will be 12, 13, 14, 15 star spawn. Or, uh, built it, mine blasters. So we may, like, make a couple more. And then, how many am I short here? So, magic being, magic beans, we've got 18 short, 13 short, and 39 short. So basically everything to these. Uh, as many as I can. Sure. So I'll be a little short on magic beings. I might actually be able to leave one of these behind and then look, load him up afterwards. Send him notes to follow up. So we'll do that. Um, this guy is building his rock walls, so we're going to throw down a temple. And hopefully. There's no brigands down here, but. What is that PD type? Garbage, of course. Um, yeah, whatever. If 
if I lose it. You know, no, we're just put the down, the lab down. Let's be let's be safe. So if the four gets aborted, I don't lose the temple too. Put the lab down. This guy will have his done next turn, so we'll be able to start the upgrade and start producing commanders down here. I'm not going to temple it. Look at those scales. I love them. We'll keep those. Uh, we got an E1, but I don't want to search waste time searching with a cat mage unless it's E2. Uh, eventually I will pull an E1 from here, and then I'm also going to start making them here. So I'll get E1 and N1 relatively fast. I'm very happy I got a D2 as my first, though. Uh, that is a, a double... Random is a 1 in 16, roughly, not including the 10 percenter, so that was relatively lucky. Normally you have to wait a while to, to accumulate your full pile of uh, doubles, so you, you know, a D2 and E2. We're not even going to assume I'll ever see an, a D3 or an E3, which is fine. Uh, E2 is enough to make crystals, um, which is really all I need, and this dude's got S65, uh, so I'm covered on everything else. And he does have, yeah, skeletal body attack rear, so he's got his thing going. <coughs> Actually, should I put him on retreat? I don't know where his Azzy is. If it's close enough, he could, like, fly in here and kill me. Um, we'll just assume that's not going to happen. I did. Like, I'm sitting in gold, and I'm not going to leave it there, and whatever. Because we're going to climb into the sea, immediately start a fort, so I can connect whatever is down here. And then, uh, from what I understand, uh, East is over here. And lol, if they think they can fight me in the water, because I'll just wreck them. I can teleport my god down there, uh, that'll push my candles in. And then I don't really care what he sends, it's not going to win in the ocean. Not against him, plus backed by Mind Blasters and Chaff. Because unlike a normal Utter Vast, he does have that D5, so he's got fear going. And he's going to, you know, they'll self-own due to the damage reversal 14, plus he's going to be killing numerous things per turn. So he doesn't have water elementals yet, so they can't stop him. Uh, I think that's everything he marks to buy. Uh, we'll see, and I spent a shitload on shipwreckers, I see. Probably, I don't mind that, because that denies it from others. I think that's pretty much it. So we're going to have all of our stuff combined here. I'll take um, a full load over to here, clear that, and then we'll take this ocean. And then we'll figure out what we're doing, probably attacking Vanheim, since I have a gentleman's agreement with TNC, and they're not a shitlord ponyman nation who will destroy the world with blood magic. Anyway, that is the turn.